get them legs. Let's move for a while. All right, what's up, Mr. Miyagi? <laughs> You should see one. me try to get in that thing. You can't get in that I, car. You better not let him see that car. Voids the warranty. <laughs> <laughs> you ever get caught in a zipper and that hurts? Are you nervous to see mom? No. You remember Aaron? What's the matter? You can't afford a haircut? You can't afford a haircut? <laughs> He's got one coming to him. He's lucky you came out this way. Because he looks just like me. <laughs> and it's just what he deserves. I'm making bagels, I'm making therapy, I might as well just be a goddamn nurse today. <laughs> when he was your age, 15? Yes. He was every mother's nightmare. And I got your husband to, to, to be thankful for, is he didn't inherit his father's uh, craziness. If I inherited his, that means I inherited yours. That means I'm 100% crazy. I want a DNA test. I may not be yours. You may not be my mother. I might have been switched at birth. I wasn't that lucky. When I croak, you tell the funeral director, I want a seat belt on my casket. I says, my apartment, I call it my new co-op, is on the seventh floor. Huh. I says that with my lock. It's gonna be in a basement. Going You're down. going down. Yeah. Some people go up, no. some people I'm, go I down. I my apartment all paid for. Somebody with a big fork's gonna be waiting for you. If that goddamn dog pisses the shits on my goddamn fake lawns or in my house, I'm gonna cut Jimmy Hart's hair. <laughs> ah, shut up, you mutt. Where's little Ben at? It's nine o'clock. There he is. He's late as usual. Probably had to stop and get himself a Egg McMuffin with sausage. He's turned into a big shot. And I'm not in a good fucking mood and I'm depressed. So I hope we don't get into a big fucking fight today because I'm ready to fucking throw in the towel and retire. I don't really need to be here today, do I? I don't really need to be here today. Your skin ain't thick today or what? I'm just, how bad of a mood are you? I mean, are you in one of those moods today? Yeah, I'm very depressed. I didn't have a lot of sleep last night. Oh, now we didn't have a lot of sleep. Smoke your cigarette. I'll have another one with you. How about that? Right, Let's have a good. morning cigarette together. First class flying. Look at that. He's sitting in first class right now. Eating a fucking Wawa sandwich, comfortable seat, air conditioning over his fucking head. Where the fuck else are you gonna get a job to provide that? Hey, you wanna talk to me on the phone? Go to benmal.com slash shop, consult with Ben. Let's talk about how you can make some money. <laughs> we know where she used to work. I had some gum work done, so I can't chew right now. What is my wife gonna make for lunch? What's for lunch, Cookie? She's hiding. You know why she's hiding? Because she didn't make me no lunch that I can eat. I thought you were going to have what Jimmy brought you. Cake? No. The soup. That's gone. I'm dependent on Jimmy Hart to feed me now. Fine, I'll eat some of your Mexican wontons. Now she's Chinese. All right, here we are at Clearwater Beach Hotel. I'm not in a good mood, but I better cool it because I gotta be nice because Garrett is responsible for all my money right now. Why are you spending so much money? You gave it to me. Popped up on my credit card today. You spent $4,200 yesterday on what? Oh, ice machine. You spent $4,200 on ice? Who in the fucking right mind would put screws in here that are not Stainless steel and rust proof. Is he stupid? But he said I'm stupid. By the salt water, you put screws in there to rust, that makes no sense. You tell him to get his ass on the plane with a bunch of screws, get back down here, and I want him to re-screw every one of these motherfuckers. The because if he don't re-screw, then I'm gonna sue. Is this Brooklyn Barry? My name is Barry. I got the privilege of coming from California to decorate a little piece of clear water with our artwork. But the problem is, you didn't use stainless steel screws and now they're all rusting through the paint and it looked like shit. It looks like the dolphins have the measles. Oh no. You need to start walking this property. Maybe you'll lose some of that goddamn fat you're getting over there. All right? Walk around the property five times a day, and I guarantee, Chubby, you'll lose about five pounds. Ben, look at these big fish. Leave me alone with your fucking <laughs> fish. I'm going to pop into my lawyer's office. You are going to sign a contract to buy a marina and hotel facility. Oh, my God. Don't do it. 
All right, let's do it. We got a car waiting. Let me tell you what my dad's gonna say when he gets here. Get these trees cut. Put some rocks out here. Come on, get all these bikes out of here. You writing these bikes out or what? No, the guy that uh, out back, we get 10% of all 10 the bikes. 10% of all the bike rental. Get rid of them. Buy your own bikes and rent them out. So basically, we're standing here the day of closing. We sent them the goddamn money. Now what's the goddamn problem? Let's go in there and find out. But we're gonna be nice. So what's your story? You got people sitting in the lobby and I don't want to be an asshole, but what's the I, I problem? Know, you got my feelings. goddamn money. What else do you want? We're getting on a plane. I'm going to the boat show in Miami. Why? I don't know. I ain't got no money to spend, but I'm going to go look. We're getting on a little plane because we're not using the jet. You know why I'm not using the jet? Because it costs too much. Oh, shit. He parked in a puddle. You know, he, can, he knows how to fly, but oh shit, I almost lost a cigarette in a puddle. He knows how to fly, but he don't know how to park so good. I'm hiding. You're not supposed to park there, but you won't get Oh shit, the gas truck is over there. We're gonna blow up, goddammit. So, we're going to Miami Boat Show and see what's available. Maybe we'll get lucky, score a good deal. Oh, this is nice. Well, this one's just owned by a customer. It's not for sale. So. Oh, you just put it here to sell new ones? Yeah. Oh, what are you wasting my time for? <laughs> my daughter lives in St. Pete. So I'm happy I for you. I really appreciate your stuff. It's very good. I appreciate it. Thank you very my much. My girlfriend, Emma. Hi, how are you? Yeah, yeah exactly. That's my, used to be my girlfriend, but 20 years ago I married oh, her. Oh, the star of the show. Hi, how uh, are the you? The real star. 20 years I've been taking from putting up with her. Hey, come to, como esta senor? Okay. You straighten out that green card, all right? My husband. It washes you all the time. The toilet floor in my house is you. You gotta hear my voice in your house? I feel sorry for my wife, too. How come I don't look like him? What are you doing with this guy? You keep him in good shape, don't you? I'm a good cop. You can put on a few pounds yourself, but that's just kidding. Quiet! I want silence today. I'm literally gonna smack you. Yeah, let's do it, because I'm ready for a fight, baby. I'm ready. Are you ready to get beat up? The problems I got, I'm ready to kick some booty. I got stuck with the woman driver today. Oh my God, I'm trying to sell cars. I'm trying to sell retail. I'm trying to sell hotels. I'm selling everything. Can I go too? And you're on the list. Ooh, yes, baby. But you come the way I got you. No, hell no. Wait, not then. <laughs> I tried to help you as much as I can. And the other thing is, it's not my fault. You want to marry a young girl. You want to be Mr. Fabio with a young Watch one. The road. I don't and want to everything. Accident. There you go. Then you pay the price. Yeah, so, I pay a price, believe me. There you go. I pay dearly. Oh, no, you don't. You don't. Please. Listen, I see you for about 20 minutes at night, and that's about it. So who are you bullshit? Lately, it's only been 10. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. You're a fucking idiot. You're crazy! Oh my god. Daddy! I thought the Boy Scouts went bankrupt. <laughs> what do you do? Research. Also research you yeah. do research. Yeah. He does day, you do night. Yeah. yeah, I can imagine. Chinese massage parlor. Come on in. <laughs> what are you? Who are you? I carry shit. I hope you're not carrying COVID. I don't want you in here. <laughs> oh shit. No. This Got guy. Another one. Where the hell did you come from? What are you like? Somewhere in between normal and midget? Yeah, two thirds the height, two thirds the price. Is that it? Anybody else? Any other wackos out there here with Kevin? And I hope there's only coffee in that fucking cup. And vodka. <laughs> Fuck. You're actually here in, in, in the presence of somebody that actually really knows real estate. Oh. Hey, how's that flip going, that $12 million mansion? Not good, you motherfucker. <laughs> My life ain't so fucking great right now. You're out there buying planes and got a fucking entourage, and guys like me are fucking starving. I already lost 10 fucking pounds. When's it gonna end, Ben? I don't know. We'll see, we're on a roller coaster, so buckle up, baby. Just don't get in a car with him when he's driving. All right, what's up, Mr. Miyagi? <laughs> you need more light? I'm good. You this want is... light? Got... You want more light? We got diffuse lighting here. We have diffuse lighting? Yeah. Okay, do you need to cook too? Because I, got... I was in a mood for Asian food tonight. I mean... You need to work a walk? <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How about to you? <laughs> Sayonara. And if you want to stay in Ben's Hotels on the eighth floor, like a big shot, penthouse suite, go to Ben'sHotels.com.
tell him Vincent sent you. All right, we're ready. Let's go. I got to eat something. What are we going to eat today, Jimmy? That's what I want to know. What are we going to eat? I haven't eaten today. Muff. And you see this? Muff. Everybody's talking Muff. about my teeth. Look, 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 look. There's the it. fucking teeth. Look. Fuck the waters. Get the cigarettes. He's worried about waters, and we got a car full of fucking water, but he ain't worried about the cigarettes, and I'm down to like a quarter of a pack. See this? I got to constantly move cigarettes from one pack to another. Keep a full pack. That's one thing about checking in here. You get all the luxury service. Can you believe a multi-millionaire, billionaire pushing me to my room? Thank you so much. Valet service to Thank the room. You. I wish I looked like dead. You mean all that money you got? Money can't buy you fitness <laughs> or a lot of things. So yes, it can. I'm lazy. Separate beds, baby. I had a bed all of myself. When we go home, you're moving in your own room. Carla wanted to go to the Grand Canyon. I mean, you know, it's a bunch of rocks. You see one rock, you see them all. Hey, man. There's smoke over there. Either way, you see the big boat coming. You have to smoke over there. Why'd they put an ashtray right there? Look at everything's fucking rocks around here. So why can't you smoke? We're going to the Indian smoking section where everybody sat around and smoked their peace pipes. Holy shit, this guy's drunk. Lift. Lift. I can't lift anymore. Lift. 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 <laughs> lift. Wherever we go, we got to make a scene. You're, you know, you're supposed to be a nurse. <laughs> now I'm ready. You're killing me. <laughs> this is what my wife calls a vacation. Rocks. Freezing out here with the rocks. <laughs> Hello, is this Graham Stephan's house? I think you have the wrong place. Oh, I'm sorry, I apologize. <laughs> you want to play jokes? You want to play around? Okay, if you, if you dish it, you better be able to take it now, chubby. You better watch who you're talking oh, to. Oh yeah? Let's chubby. do it. We could be sumo wrestlers. I'm Jewish, and you look a little Japanese. Listen here, pipsqueak. You know what a pip is? <laughs> I have no clue. Property improvement plan. <laughs> And you need some improvement. <laughs> we can do it together. Yeah, you should see one. me try to get in that thing. You can't get in that I, car. You better not let him sit in that yeah, car. Voids the warranty. <laughs> <laughs> Are you Japanese? Excuse me. You know what year it is, baby? You can't just, you can't just go around with so many people. What? You're not Japanese? No. What are you, Indian? You don't have any Indians that no. fat. <laughs> you're just a mix of everything. Uh, no, you're, no. You're, you're a fucking what I, buffet. No, that's what I get. <laughs> All right, here we are at the Graham Stephan Show. That's right. Well, the iced coffee. I ran away from home when I was 12 years old. I was a big 12 year old. Well, why'd you do that? I'm not as big as him, but you know. I've actually never had a cigarette in my life. Really? Yeah. Yeah, but you've had plenty of burritos, I can tell you that. <laughs> Your dog shits that much in one day? Oh, yeah. <laughs> what are you laughing at? I hate to see what you put out in a day. Holy shit. Honestly, this house is perfect for you. It's just like a mansion or a little guy like you, isn't it? You got the, the hot tub, the pool, the alleyway. You can't even make the turn in that alleyway. Who are you bullshitting? How you doing? How you doing? How are you? How are you? I'm good. Told you to keep the cuckoos away from me. Let's make some money this year. In honor of Carla, we're gonna have Mexican tonight. You made it back to the border, baby. Back to the border. This is what you call a popper. Well, why would you come so early in the morning? Who the hell are you bringing this time? The same as last time. You're crazy still at this age? You know, for a lady that didn't do shit her whole life for a son, you should be telling me not what to do and not what to do. You should be fucking happy and to do anything you can to fucking get along with one human being. She hung up. We're not going to see her.
We were gonna go pay my mother a visit. You think she'd be happy that her son wants to visit her after a rotten goddamn life she gave me? But no, she don't want us to come there and film or do anything. She wants to live a miserable life and be a miserable bitch. She's stupid. She's been like that her whole life. She's a fucking lunatic. She's totally fucking mental. And she just did me a favor because I didn't want to visit her ass anyway. There you go. Let's go somewhere else like a Broadway show instead of her fucking horror show. We went to park the car. On the way back to the hotel, Carla found a place she wanted to stop. And let me tell you, nobody loves margaritas like Carlita. When you go through this door, it takes you to a freight elevator. And we ran into some freight. <laughs> you can't make this up, man. I think we might have to move back. Shut up. <laughs> oh, I'm moving this garbage. You stay there. You're safe. You might get past her, but it wasn't getting past me. Now we lost the elevator. This is bullshit. I'm standing next to garbage, waiting to take her to a rooftop bar in New York City, Times Square. Donald hey, Trump, hey, don't hey, put up with yeah, this shit. Yeah, that's why I'm either. Okay? Normally, you're supposed to go somewhere nice, you don't have to worry about it. But no, we have to do it Ben Mallow's way. Ben Mallow's move. Ben's move. <laughs> she don't need a margarita. Oh my god. Oh shit. There we go. Carla! What's up? Tonight, we got one hour before our first Air Ben and B will be here. Oh, God. Do you have two rooms ready? The top room and their associates. Look at this. Do you smell it? No, it's on camera, they can't smell. Oh. <laughs> it does smell good. Okay, you got candles going. We got air freshener in case they stink. I hope he can fit through this fucking glass. He's bigger than me, I think. I could fit in. You have to tell him to turn sideways. Remind me to tell the guy that's staying in this room, he's real big, to turn sideways before he goes in the shower. I'm not telling him that, are you crazy? Remind me to tell him. Is that the best soap you got? There's like a little tiny yeah, bit. Yeah, I've seen that, I've seen that. I've seen that, I've seen that. i seen that, you've seen no, do nothing. <laughs> Just put out the stuff we steal from all I the hotels. It. I got it, I purposely make her steal all the stuff from the good hotels, so when we have guests, give them the stuff that we stole from the good hotels. This is what you leave in this apartment? No. Look this looks like there. leftover from a Chinese takeout. You guys do not want to know how much this damn place costs. How much? They look like Walmart to me. Seriously, these look like freaking Walmart to you? Made in England. Yes. I bet you it's still made in China and you just put the stamp on it. Oh, you put made in England. We'll see how this Air Ben and B goes. It's all, let me tell you, it's all in the health. It's our mystery Air Ben and B guest. You need an elevator? I think, I think my elevator can handle you. I'm terrified, because if I get stuck in here, it's gonna be a bad day I'm gonna get stuck in here. Oh, oh my suck. god. Oh, 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 oh. oh fuck. Turn up your phone. Hey, it's big. I, I, I might, I'm, I'm not good, but I'm in the elevator, and I'm coming out right now. Tell your son you love. Holy shit. We have put a lot of stress in this. I've never seen this thing go slow. I hope we fucking make it. <laughs> oh shit, it's on a shake. No, 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 no. You're ruining my fucking elevator. It's barely working. Oh shit. Come on. Oh, <laughs> I've never seen this elevator go slow. Is he gonna make so it? Should we just stop it here? What are we gonna do? There's no way out. <laughs> We're fucked. I'm killing my elevator. How slow is this normally? Now let's see if we're lined up with the floor. <laughs> no way. That's oh, oh my god. god. No. As soon as you guys get off the lifts. <laughs> Holy crap. Can I try your glasses on? My glasses? Yeah. These are Louis Vuittons, you know that. These are. Those are Walmart. <laughs> oh my god. Your eyes oh, are shut. Oh yeah, Whoa. baby. Everyone just standing around, go make some money. I don't know if that polo was made for a man or the horse. <laughs> yeah, everybody's got their own taste. Well, I don't think you got much of a wall. What? Let's see if shirt number one is gonna fit you. It's only a four. I don't think you've been a four since you were 15. Does it fit? Yeah, Does it no, button? No, no, no. And if you don't like something, just tell me and I'll give it to another fat guy. Uh, seriously, man? <laughs> you wanna look like a giant tablecloth. You ready? 
<laughs> Honey, I shrunk the kids. Very good. You look like a real picnic, the table. There you go, S.A. Go, S.A. There you go. Now you're ready to go to prison. Oh, that's my style, too. Yeah. Listen, if it fits you, it's your style. Do you have, like, one of those retail sticks? I don't sticks? Know, I always go like this. What? I don't know if you get your big ass in these pants. I'm not even in the 50s. You're a liar. I swear to God. You know, it's one thing. You know what? Don't take your clothes off, please. <laughs> oh my God, look, look at the shorts he's wearing. He even has food on his underwear. You're one tough lady, let me tell you. Thanks. <laughs> she was broke, and then she saw money. She said, I know I eat good with him. <laughs> So how was your stay at- Ben Aaron B is amazing. So far it looks pretty good. I don't see nothing broken yet. Okay. You get all your crap out of oh, here. Oh, don't go in. Could you just not? I, I, it's just kind of messy. What? What the hell are you doing in my closet? Now, who the fuck are you? You know? So I didn't see anything in the contract that said I couldn't sublet it. And Michael Reeves is in town and I thought, we just put them in the closet. You know? Looks like you need to put them in a dishwasher. Yeah, and that's what I'm fine. Hmm. Did they leave something in my trunk? What the hell is going on? What the <laughs> fuck? Everybody keeps no. asking, where's Vincent? What's going on with the properties he bought? He's taking apartments and turned them into a boat yard. Welcome to Vincent's Compound. You're gonna find all kinds of things here. If you need some used building materials, come on down to Vincent's. Where'd you get all this shit from? You stole it from me? Come on down to Vincent's. You can pick up some flooring here. We got a nice carpet for sale. We got broken pavers. You can do the whole mosaic look. All right, right now it's storage. Let me tell you something. You wanna hit a real deal? You wanna hit a real fucking deal? They got a lot of fucking nerve putting all this fucking shit here with the fucking boat and the place looking like a fucking disaster. All right, they're disrespecting you, having this place look like a fucking junkyard. Let me talk to them. I'll have Luis translate. We got a new boat, baby! And it cost us half the price as the last one. So nice, this is bath. your bedroom, right? This is my bedroom. This is your bedroom. Yours. yours across the hall. Look at that bathroom. I fit through the door, watch. I can fit. I don't think Alex could. Window, so I can smoke. <laughs> You're definitely not smoking in here. Yes, I am. Next boat will have an elevator. Ha, 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 ha! <laughs> Listen, lady, you're the stew. And the stew will do what I tell you to do. First class, baby, on a yacht. You want tomato? No, no, I'm on a diet. I don't want any of those vegetables. We're here, we got a boat, and back at the house again. Here's the boat keeper. He is what you call the master baiter. Let me tell you something about this boat. You know what the best thing about this boat is? It's half the price of the last one, and it's got more amenities. This is a man's yacht. It's bigger. I'm going to have to charge you more dock and rent. And there's your room right there. My neighbors are going to be happy. They don't have to watch me walk around in my backyard in my boxers anymore. Rafal is forcing me to watch TikToks and give my opinion. I've owned over 2,000 pieces of real estate in my life. I've got several hundred million dollars worth of real estate today. One thing I know for sure is if you tell me the renters are going to pay the payments for you, that tells me you've never managed rental property. You are a novice at best, an idiot at worst. And, um, I mean, that's the truth. Who the fuck else is going to pay Anybody it? who's ever had a renter knows that sometimes renters don't pay. The fucking world is sometimes, you idiot. And why are you calling people idiots? You're the fucking idiot, you egotistical fucking maniac! Who is this obnoxious fucking guy? Don't talk down to people, talk up to people. Who the fuck else is gonna pay you but the rent? Of course sometimes, sometimes. You know what that fucking, if you do your job right and you screen your tenants and you put the right tenant in the right fucking place, everything will be fine. Life ain't perfect. You allow for certain things to happen when you're in real estate, if you know what the fuck you're doing and not just talking about it. His opinion is stupid. What is he telling people? Don't go into real estate? Is this the don't go into real estate channel? Then why the fuck do you got hundreds of millions of it? Who knows? Oh no. Uh, some type of march yeah, yeah. for the Latins today, right? Look, they're all parking here for free. Parking parking here. Here. The only me this happens to. I gotta be, I have a parking lot across the street from where they want to protest. They're all they're parking all every 
parking spot. No, I don't want to start a scene, but everybody here can get towed. I get yeah, towed. So Every you car do? here. But what are you going to do in a situation like this? I don't know, Dad. Call it's the police. first time I ever had a situation like this. I'm the owner. I, this is ridiculous. Ay, 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 ay. No breaks for me. We own all this, too, right? Yes, we own the whole fucking plaza. You've never been here? Oh. He's wearing his Mexican shirt. <laughs> I don't believe this life I got. And what do we got here? Ben Jr.'s been working on this goddamn place for a goddamn year. When's he gonna finish? I love the way, you know what? First of all, stop with the telling people lies. I'm not lying. I'm gonna call you out. This ain't been a year. We started this project one month ago, maybe two. How long has it been empty? It doesn't matter how long it's been empty. I told you it what to do as soon as project. it was empty. Okay, when I started the project two months ago. Not my fault it's been empty. You started the project. You're so full of crap. We just got a lease signed. All right, what do we got left to do? You don't see what's left to do? Is this coming down? Yes. Take it down. What's the holdup? How come nobody's here working? What's going on? I don't know. We got the ACs going in, then the drop ceiling will go back in, and then we're done. When? This is not even the space that we're, I mean, this is vacant. What do you mean this when? Is not the, this is the space Publix is getting. 45 days. This is the space Publix is getting. No. Publix is it next door? Yes. Let's go to the Publix side. That's okay. the one waiting to move in, waiting for that I don't money. know if I can get in. What do you need to get in for? To see where the hell we're at. It's a, it looks just like this one. There's wood, I don't have screws and everything. When can we deliver it to Publix? Today we're seeing behind the scenes how Ben Mallet Jr. is running the company. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm embarrassed, because this is ridiculous. Like, is this our responsibility? Mike Winger cuts weeds for a living. Like, this is crazy. And look at this couch out here. This is not our couch. And this guy's taking up all my front. Oh, oh shit, I can't even get over there. What the fuck? Where? Why is every, why is this shit like this? <laughs> is your copier machine from your house? What do you want me to do, throw this away? This is worth at least 50 bucks. These are the windows from John's past that you made me save. Everything's in here because of you. See if you got a Rolls Royce tire for your brother. Everybody's telling me always go to the gym. Well, I'm here, I'm at the gym, baby. But I ain't going in. <laughs> Check out my new t-shirt. Guess who gave me this? Snoop Dogg's roadie. And he gave me something specially for you, baby. For me? For you, look at this. Can I join Death Row Records? Yes, sir! Can you sing? Yeah, I can rap. First of all, let me give you this. Look, Death Row Records. This is official Snoop Dogg merchandise. Look at this, man. Look at that, Death Row. <laughs> California. Don't want about it. Yo, 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 what's up, what's up? <laughs> Jimmy Hart's in the house. Death Row. Don't make me get shugnated on your ass. We have a problem here. Because of the good hot weather, people come to Florida and they're willing to sleep outside. So. Yeah, you need to go, guy. Trying to get a quick seat there. Thank you, thank you. People smoking black and milds. In San Francisco, I used to find syringes everywhere. Here, you just find black and miles. I need a favor. What you need, sir? The stores are complaining about people hanging out in front. It's disrupting, making them, you know, not look well, cool. The, so do me a go. favor. I won't ask this a I favor. Let's go somewhere else. If they give us somewhere to go, we'll, we're well, I don't know what to tell you. Go, go across the street. Cool. Thank you very much, and have a nice day. You too, sir. You too, sir. I need their rent money. Well, if you give me a job, I'll, I'll... Shit, I'm broke right now. I'm broke, you wanna see broke? Look, this is broke. This is broke. Okay, I'm broke. What you got? A nice car down there. Come with me, bro. What do you want, this wall? You wanna paint this wall here, or what? Give me a brush, I'll paint it, sir. No. I need a job. What? I need a job. No. I know. I do, man. I hear you. All right, we're all gonna guess. How much does he want to cut and remove these trees? What? Cut it right here and fall down. Too much. What? Holy shit. Because you know, I have to pay the don't feed, you know. 
The dump fees, it's natural wood, should be free. No, nobody is here free, you know. Eight guys in what? Half a day? Yeah. Half a day. Yeah. Cuatro horas. That cost you $800. The dump is $800, $1,600, $2,000, $2,500. Deal. Yeah. 28. Both 28. trees, yeah. adios. Okay, Thank yeah. you. All right, here we are. One of my favorite places in Fort Lauderdale, Pumperdale. The people are happy, but the food's really good. I'm going to have a nice, big, fat pastrami sandwich. All right. The big one? The big one. My wife's not with me, and I'm going to eat anything I want. Supersize it. <laughs> Potato pancakes with applesauce and sour cream. We're going Jew all the way today, lady. That's what I'm talking about. You're the Jewish person in the whole joint. 112.29. What? That's it? That's all? Take it out of there. Hey, the lady. And I mean that Thank lady. You. I called her a lady today. All right. Let us know when our food's ready. Have it delivered. Okay. You want to bring it myself? Bring it, but bring it backwards. Yeah, I know you want to see all this. This is the face of the franchise. Thank God she's the face. I always thought about it. Mary a daughter of her father owned a deli. But I'm already there. It doesn't look like you missed many meals, though, does it? <coughs> How do you know you're well? You seen a doctor lately? I have my blood done. What was the alcohol level when he did it? I take care of myself. He has to. Nobody else wants to. You're saying dirty things about me? I'll clean you up. Believe me, the last thing in the world I'm going to say about you is something dirty. Okay, thank you so much. <laughs> my mind don't go there. Happily married for... I know. And your wife Almost is 20 wanted. years I've been being punished. When you're punished for 20 years, you just say, forget about it. Hey, Aaron, you try to take the Tabasco, a mustard? We need it for the boat. 100 bucks for lunch, I'm stealing something. Oh, is that you on there? That's me, I'm the face of How long ago was that picture? <laughs> <laughs> you're working it too hard. <laughs> All right, we're taking the boat out for the first time, and we're going to the Bahamas, baby. Next stop is Bimini. We get to the beach and meet our first cuckoo. Oh. <laughs> I had to take a picture with you. Oh yeah, because I watch a show all week long, and now I deserve a picture. That's right. How many drinks have you had today? <laughs> and I know your wife, and I know that's the not my wife. And I know the Shh, that That's my girlfriend. Know. That's not my wife. No, that's it. And she's the boss, by the way. What is your job? Who? What is your job, Parker? Hopefully. Speak you English. You be both. I'm like less. We wanted to test out the tender. So I said, Aaron, let's take a ride. First time on the boat, baby. Oh, shit. <laughs> Best thing to do with these guys is don't say shit. I'm telling you now, let me just deal with them. Don't say a fucking thing. How's everyone? Good. Pretty good, pretty good. What's up? Same kind of machinist in the system that was reported stolen. We, we need to conduct a audit. Uh, you have any firearms on board this vessel? No, sir. There's no registration number for this vessel. Is well, there a reason for that? We just bought the boat. We bought it from a dealer, and he was supposed to handle everything. But we do have the bill of sale approving we bought the boat. When, when did you guys enter BMW water? I'm sorry, say it again, I can't hear very well. How long have you been in BMW water? Oh, we got here yesterday on that big boat right there behind us. Oh, we're staying at the Bimini Resort. Okay. So, so you're the captain? Yeah, I drive the boat. Yes, sir. That's my son. You have an ID? You have an ID? ID? On yeah. Any ID from yeah. one of you guys? Oh, shit, I didn't bring an ID. Oh, 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 my gosh. Hey, if you don't have an ID, you, you, you got to come into Bimini with me so I can find out who you are. Look at this. <laughs> that, that's not going to work. And I'm going to let you know that that's bribery in the Bahamas. He's joking. He's, just joking. He's joking. He's joking. He's just joking. He's from New York. You don't know any better. Do you guys have flotation devices on this vessel? Yes, yeah, flotation device. Got these two. You have one? We just bought it thinking it was all equipped. Hey, call the captain. Maybe he knows. Okay. Oh, it's got a bathroom. I didn't even know the boat had a bathroom. We got flare, yeah. air horn. Yo, I'll be ready to clear Bahamas Custom and Immigration. So, so what's inside the cooler? Uh, open up the cooler. I think it's empty. Got a rack. Brand new, never Brand used. New. <laughs> Wanna buy it? <laughs> Don't do me a favor, now's not the time. <laughs> There's certain times in your life when you have to shut the fuck up, and now is one of them. Us on a fishing trip? 
No fishing. No Just fishing. pleasure. No, no spare gas. Let Nothing. Anybody else on, on board your yacht? On my yacht? Yeah, our, our two families. <laughs> Why is he laughing? Huh? He said firearm. Oh, firearm. I thought you said how many family members or something. It's hot out here. We have no firearms whatsoever on our boat. No. Except my wife. She's a pistol. When, when are they going to start the registration up? I hope as soon as I get back to Fort Lauderdale, it'll be sitting in my mailbox. But I, I advise you not, not to bring this boat back to my house unless you get the proper registration done. Yes, sir. Uh, you guys take care. I'm a doctor, you know? You're a doctor? I will tell you. Are you a psychiatrist? No. Because I got all I'm, these crazy I'm, I'm people in, I'm here. I'm internal medicine. They say, I internal. will tell Ben Mala, listen, Ben Mala, please stop smoking, do exercise. You have a beautiful family, all right? You have to take care of that family for many years to come, right? You're a doctor? You need to come. Oh, come, come on, buddy. Crowds. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. This is my wife. Your wife? Yeah. I know it's your daughter. Oh. You said it yourself. We're in the Bahamas. We're supposed to have a good time. You want a good time? Yes, a good time. A you good want a good time? I'll give you a good time, lady. <laughs> come on. Grab the rope. You grab a rope. I was in the army. I don't need a rope. I was an army seal. Get her off of me. Oh, shit. Oh, somebody help me. I'm falling. Oh, shit. Baron, help me. He looks like a fucking, he's ready to kill somebody. <laughs> he's got that big hook like he's ready to tow somebody. He wants to know if uh, we'll help him push this truck out of here. It's going downhill, should be easy. I'll we're happy to help you. Well, I wouldn't say we're happy, but we will help you. One guy's 100 overweight, he's 100 years old, and we're pushing fucking trucks in the Florida heat. Yeah! 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 All right, that's enough already. How far are we going to fucking New York? I like you, Bob. Thank you. <laughs> You're not towing it, believe me. I'll call somebody else. Oh, yeah, yeah. Why the fuck didn't he cut the weeds with a fucking weed whacker? Come on, I want this shit gone. Have him wash the front. What the fuck is this? A barrel? We're putting a body in there? Stop, all right? I'm not in the mood, all right? Just stop, all right? I don't want to get in a fight with you. All right, you but don't stop. want to get into a fight, but you do everything stop. to start a fight with me. Stop. I actually okay. not. You don't like to videotape some stuff. I don't want the car anymore. You're pissing me off. I don't want I it. I mean, no, you're crossing the line. I don't want to drive around and everybody, oh, your daddy bought your Rolls Royce. Truthfully, you should have bought me three Rolls Royces for the shit I've been dealing with for five years on this place. You know, but I you spoiled just can't you too much, and you talk to me like a piece of shit. A and I'm tired of, of shit. it. I'm had it. I'm tired of about? it. Do me a favor. Go away. You do it. Go you away. Want all go the away. Time. Go away. Go away. Go away. Just go the fuck away. Okay? Because now you're crossing the line. Telling you to take the car back? Yes. Fucking can't get a break with these kids. The more I fucking give, the more they want. And you embarrass me, the fucking bars are here, and he's starting shit for no reason. I've had it with that bullshit. I bite my tongue for you your whole life. For your whole life, I bit my tongue with you. You know why? You know why? I know why. I know multiple reasons why. Fucking done. I'm tired of you, your bullshit. I'm tired of your brother's bullshit. I'm tired of Brendan's bullshit. I've had it with all of yous. And when the more fuck I do, the worse I get treated. Go away. Go the fuck away. Fuck. We got a new tenant. Damn, he's gone. He's sleeping. He's got his phone playing with a little music. I'm going to have to tell him he's got to go. I'm sorry. Yes, sir. Buddy. Sorry to disturb your nap, but I can't have you sleeping here. I apologize. I know it's a cool spot. It's just it's money, though. I'm just coming up. Right here, you see a millionaire in the making. Millionaire in the making? I love it, baby. I love it. I'm less fortunate right now, but I've been fortunate for the past ten years. Okay. Very small through the divorce. Understood. Understood. Time. Hey, man, you take care. I appreciate it. Holy shit! There's another guy on the other side. Each space has got a tenant already. Chilling. They look comfortable. Well, I hope this guy's as nice as the last one. Excuse me. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Yeah, I can't have you staying here, unfortunately. I appreciate it. I hate climbing in this stupid thing. You know, I don't know why people jack their trucks up high. Oh, my God. One, two, three. 
Why do we take the jet and spend all that money? Well, because Carla went online and tried his commercial tickets, and the prices are insane. It would have cost us on average about two grand a piece. Round trip. Well, there's six of us. Six times two is twelve thousand dollars. If they let me keep the plane and I have to fly it back and forth, comes out to the same money. So we took our own plane. A lot better than going commercial, let me tell you. First cigarette in Montreal. Hi, bonjour. I just, I'm sorry, I was just noticing the bear. I couldn't, I had to stop and look at it. You can't fit that in a plane? Yeah, we can. Could probably make it fit. I'll trade you the bear for her. That's a good deal. <laughs> but let me tell you, she comes at a big price tag. High maintenance. Oh, but you cannot take it to the floor to the guy. Why not? No, we have a plane. Bear. I can take the black bear home. The black, yeah. I have one standing black bear, sir. Come over. That would have fit on the plane. That one here is eight, $8,500. 85 or 45? 80, 85. How about 55? So, uh, $6,500 and you pay shipping. What about the rug? How much for the rug? Come on. The rug? Do I hear $500 for the rug? $500 for the rug? No. I Do I hear think. $500? $600? $3,000 American, sir. $3,000 for the rug? Am American dollars for you. American dollars? Yeah. I, I like Canadian dollars better. 3,000 Canadians better. It'll be 4,000. All right, <laughs> I'm going to think about both of those pieces. Okay, sir. And then you think about it. Okay. It used to be fun. Yeah. I like that. Like yeah, all time. But no, now, I have to work seven Now you want to work and make money. You know why? Because you have fun later. Yeah. First you work hard, you make money, then you got plenty of time for fun. <laughs> this guy looks smart. I'm going to tell you right now. I know smart people when I meet them. And this guy's smart. And when the people are smart, you got to be careful. And you know, he has a... He has a um... He has also a life-threatening uh, illness, you know? Oh, and it doesn't sorry. stop him. Yeah, I need a kidney, so... Yeah, he needs a kidney right now, so... Are you on the list, or...? Yeah, quite a... I try, but... They have in, a list here, the there? I, I have on the list, but you it's quite you? long because... I don't know how to buy one. I know about how it goes on. I, I mean, think of that, too. You have one working, right? No, not... Uh, the Neither way. kidneys I work. have one, and it doesn't work. Yeah, you only have one, and yeah. it doesn't work. I'm sorry, but I'm sure if you, you're a positive guy. Oh, yeah. You keep thinking positive, then, you know, positive things are going to happen. Yeah. I don't believe it. I had to come all the way to Montreal to find a big and tall Tommy Bahama. I'll take it, and I'll probably pick a few more. It feels good. This material's nice. It makes me look thin. I'm looking good, baby. This is going to be my new yachting shirt. Uh, I'll go on the yacht today. You ever get caught in a zipper? That hurts. She was right. I'm big on top and small down below. All right, so we got some shirts. We got some shorts. A suit? The jacket was very good quality, and it's definitely worth the 50% off special you're running. <laughs> Why is she laughing? What a freaking comedian. You didn't put the 20% off for Wait, all the time your mom brought it. Are you hungry or something? Yeah, hungry to save money. You know? <laughs> hungry? It was a pleasure meeting you. Same it was an experience meeting her. <laughs> How are you, sir? How are you? Because of you, I bought a motel, huh? You bought a motel because of me? Yeah, I did. Do I get a free night? Um, 150, oh, you, know, 150, you buy some hotel because of me, but I can't get a free night. That's all right. I probably don't want to stay there. Habla español? Claro que sí. Oh. Vine, vine desde Ottawa nomás para verlo. Yeah. Acabo de, acabo de salir. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah. yeah. Adios, amigo. Uh-oh. Here come the cops. Here come the cops. Here come the cops. Here come the cops. Hey, it was nice seeing everybody. <laughs> Thank you. Cops are here. I don't need security. <laughs> Who's going to, you're going to run after somebody, Biggie? <laughs> No, no, I'll slow them down. I'll just sit on them or something. <laughs> Me and you together could crush them. The last time I went to Jamaica, yeah. my wife, she was eating a jerk chicken. <laughs> she wanted a jerk all night. Ah! <laughs> what happened? They got married? They got engaged. They got engaged? You better come talk to me. Let me just, let me give him education. What do you have to say? Congratulations. If we get divorced, basically, anything you got to tell me, you're going to have to go through Aaron. <laughs> if we get divorced and you're stuck in the middle, I'm going to be telling you what to tell her. She's going to be telling you what to tell me. Listen, you tell your mother, goddammit. I'm not giving her no more goddamn money. You're out of your allowance and that's all you get. I'm going to tell you. Well, you better tell your daddy. <laughs>
He's giving me more. I don't think like this it or is not. healthy. Parent. Sometimes less <laughs> is more. Do you go pee? You know damn well you cannot go pee right now. You better hold it. You didn't remind me before we got on a plane. Seriously, I have to remind you now that you have to go pee? Yes, that's what you do with old people. Oh, oh shit. Well, Almost knocked the down. drink Look over. I never used a bathroom on this plane before. But he gonna get stuck there. I'm staying back here. This is the most comfortable seat on the plane. Probably pressure washer all this shit. Can this door be painted? Yeah, it's gotta be sanded first. Sanded? Yeah. Nah, use some good paint, go over that shit, fuck it. <laughs> all right. Use a little tiny brush, yeah, you know? Yeah. yeah, like the one you use in school. Yeah, yeah, art class. Or by the looks of him in prison. Uh-oh, the IRS is here. Get out of here. I knew he was following me around, the IRS. I turned the tax return in already. Leave me alone. <laughs> we work for Patrick Bet David. Patrick Bet, Bet David. David. That rings a bell. Give you a tour of the Valuetainment headquarters, the podcast studio, the vault. Come on in, guys. Who picks your clothes out every day? Your mommy? I do. This is the famous vault. The vault, where's the money? See, if anybody comes in here and causes any trouble, they see him, they ain't causing no trouble. <laughs> How's Shug doing? Hey, he'll, he'll, be out building. he'll be out soon? Yeah, I'm gonna hook up with him when he gets out. What's up, man? Adam, Adam, man, how, are how are you? you? How's he Great doing? Great to meet you. Why don't you learn from these guys? These guys know how to color, co color coordinate and dress. What time do you start your limo job? Any real estate? No, I'm actually a, a, a big renter guy and I own REITs. Cause I keep it moving, flexible. Boom, 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 boom. boom, boom, boom. Yeah. Basically, he doesn't want to get his hands dirty. He's a big prima donna. He doesn't want to work for a living. He'd rather put yes. his money somewhere and let other people work for a living. Correct. Smart guy. Yeah. The top. You? I don't know. <laughs> How you doing, right. man? Good to see you. How long have you been out now? <laughs> when do you get a desk in this joint? This is my desk with all the inspirational. Oh, the one that says men's on it? It's good to hire the special needs. <laughs> Oh, I have two ducks. I have two ducks. That quack, I quack. For, um, and a cat. Listen, stop telling me. The more ducks. you tell me, the stranger I think you are. I thought you were already strange. Oh, great emotional support animals for this Emotion. generation. It's all about the emotional support, you know? Uh, you know, I got the opposite. I got a wife. That's the opposite of emotional support. You better not let them get loose and go around any Chinese restaurant in your neighborhood because yeah. they'll be gone. Yeah. Good to see you, buddy. Good to see you. What the hell are you wearing? Well, you know why he has to wear that? Because he never knows when he's got to run. <laughs> <laughs> he always want to be in a running suit. Man, you know what I love best about this place? A beautiful, brand new ashtrays. You know, that's class. Well, Ben, you know the old saying we have. When there's a vacant space, you will race. Get set, go! Cheaters, cheaters, cheaters. Oh, my phone. That's what you get for cheating. This right here, they gotta trim this tree up. Somebody gets hit in the eye, it's 100 grand, easy. Oh, shit, that's 100 grand. Dad, give me 100 grand right now. I'll settle out of court right now for $5. And now, I'm gonna have breakfast. First thing you do when you wanna have breakfast, one paper plate. Why? So you don't have to wash no dishes. Breakfast of champions, of kings. Kings eat in a castle. You put them on the plate, you pop open a micro. Three, two, one, ready, baby! And breakfast is served. It's a dab, it's a small burger. Dab there. Oh my God, I put too much. Breakfast is now Serve. This one got a little messed up, but it's all right. Manny has customized his own truck. He's a do-it-yourself type of guy, and he saw the stars in my Rolls Royce. He tried to copy him. What the hell is that, a map of fucking Texas? Texas, Texas, Oh baby. my God, this guy's such a Texan. Hey, what are we filming? Speak Spanish, habla español? Absolutamente que habla Spanish. Here you go, Manny, baby. Speak Spanish. It's your lucky night. Oh, I tell you, so he's lucky. <laughs> I feel like I'm on a Mexican soap opera uh, novella right now. Don't drink a drink, Manny. Don't drink a drink. Oh my God. <laughs> you can't make this up. <laughs> anyway, tonight's Manny's night. It's my night off. I gotta go get Manny a fucking tetanus shot now. <laughs> but if you want to hear the real story about this car, tell him the truth, because we only talk the truth with us. How did you get the car? My mom gave me this car. Ain't so that sweet. I'm sure you're a real chick magnet in this baby. I am not. I am not. Maybe you can pick up Chinese girls, you know, small. So go in a Korean neighborhood, oh, yeah. and when they see, oh, you have Korean 
Oh, Seoul, Korea. Very nice. So don't let him fool you with the Mr. Oh, I'm Mr. Nice Guy. You know, I wear a tie and a vest. Bullshit. He's scheming on your ass, trust me. <laughs> Hey, he didn't eat yet, so I'm gonna have to find him something to eat. And I don't live here, so I don't shop much. But we got a banana tree over here. All right, how are you gonna get a banana? Should I jump up there? Be my oh, guest. Oh, oh, oh. This guy's a good shape. One thing is, look at that. It's kind of green, but it's, it's hard not, as a yeah, rock. It's hard as a rock. Forget it. Oh, Just throw man. the whole thing in the water. Okay. But when they do ripen, I'll let you know. And even if I'm not here, oh my God, you're crazy. That was so crunchy. You're not supposed to eat a hard banana. That's beyond not ripe. Tastes good. You're nuts. Where's Duckman sitting? Okay. You should sit outside, but go ahead and sit down with us. This is another level of flavor. This is good enough for Bet David. This is what happens when you lose your driver's license. <laughs> and you can't ride in the rain because you're on a bike. Yeah, he's got a driver's license, all right. This is what happens when you get a DUI. Look what he's driving. Look at that, baby. You know, driving around with some class. Look at that. Here come Tiger Woods, y'all. Look at Tiger Woods, y'all. Who the hell parked this Maserati next to the Rolls Royce parking? Get this you know, shit out of here. Two Royces and a Ratty. Woo. Yeah, I see myself in one of these one day. He sees himself in everything. Hey, you let me borrow the everything but the gym. Look, there's a place across the street. Bad cock. That's where you came from. I know, and that's what, <laughs> this is what happens. When you got a bad cock, this is what happens you produce. He got a bipolar cock. It produced two different colors. Hey, you, you do look good. skinny. You're looking good. You're looking great. He's wearing a good shirt now like I wear. He's this looking is a slim. 3X. He's ready, baby. It's a 3X. A 3? Oh, my goodness. I was in 4s for a while. He was in 4s. Now I'm in 3s again. Very good. I'm I, down to 2. I got all my... That is not a 2. You are such a lie. Give me that. That's a three. You're wearing a. Th that's a tall though. Yeah, you're that's taller. Good. I'm taller Same than you. Same 3x, and you still got room in it. Look wow. at that. I got plenty of room. I can you're move my good. family in there. You're good. You're looking good. Go to BenMel.com/shop and consult with Ben, and we'll go over the deal so you don't overpay. Down to one minute, baby. One minute. Press the button and spend push a million bucks. Push it. I can push that push button it. right now. Push and it. A I'll kill push you. it. Push the goddamn button. I'll kill you. Damn it. He'll do it too. <laughs> He'll do it and say, oh shit. I'll go there every day. I'll make it up. I'll get you your million back. Don't worry. <laughs> Why is the machine out of order? Oh my God, now I know why we're out of order. Why is the machine not working? What are you guys doing? Calm down. We got a spot for y'all on the fifth floor. You know, I'm gonna put you in the fifth floor at a mental hospital. We might have found a job Jimmy's qualified for. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Did you see the arm come down and slap the hell out of her fall? <laughs> I think I hit a fucking pothole. Fuck, come on. Slowly, don't fuck up the rim. All right, fuck it, stop right there, stop, stop. Straighten the wheel. I just asked your stupid ass Who the fuck straight. changes tires on crooked wheels? <laughs> Look at this. What the fuck? Oh. Hell yeah! <laughs> Put it out. Put it out. I've always wanted to do that shit. <laughs> Thank you, Vincent. I'm having a picnic, baby. Coffee? Look what we got inside of here. Carla's not here. <laughs> I got donut balls. They don't look like holes. They're balls. They come out of a hole. Pack of cigarettes. I'm having a picnic at Dunkin' Donuts. Mmm, these are good. Ooh, donut holes. They are my oh, donuts. Oh, god damn. It's greedy. I see why cops like coffee and donuts. Careful of the mirrors, I might be moving a dent. Oh my God, you're messing up the tile. Sorry. Just like in kindergarten. Don't you dare. <laughs> he got quick hands. You're messing up the tile. Well, you're the one that said, let's do a kickball in the freaking indoors. In the let's see you Stop guys. playing around. How about Play that? Baseball. How about we stick to work? Yeah, let's stick to work. Let's not have a good time. Let's not have no fun. Let's practice boring real estate. Okay, we're here. All right, let's go. 
Yeah. Shut Get up. up! Give me the fucking ball. Because I want to take that ball. Hit him. Fucking baby. <laughs> sausage, I love sausage. Breakfast. This is how do you give me breakfast on a plane? I don't even know what class this is. It's called hillbilly class. Have your attention for a moment, please. In the interest of safety, please observe the seatbelt and no smoking signs. Fuck. Toilet paper and pans. Somewhere to put the food and you know what to get rid of it. Moonshine. This is real deal moonshine and this is how you can tell. Are you ready? What? Do you want me to drink that? <laughs> Little Billy body work. Two more. Up. So. Pitt, what are you doing to my poor son? So, so Ben Jr. He he wrecked a ATV the other day, and they've got a hold on his card. So I'm I've got a number he doesn't know, and I'm texting him pretending to be the people, and it says hello Benjamin. Based on our expert estimation, the cost of repairing the unit damaged by your reckless operation will be $13,426.37. We will process your card immediately. Th thank you from the Mala family for your continued business. Call me with any concerns on this number. He's about to shit his pants. Dad, we got a problem. Here, let me read you a text that was sent. <clears throat> Hello, Benjamin. Your reckless operations will be $13,426. We will process your card immediately. Thank you to the Mala family for your continued business. Call the number. Call the guy. Call, call him up. Got a lawyer right here. Where you going, lawyer? Uh, oh, shit. <laughs> your grandfather's a little... Come on. Is this... Is this uh... Benjamin Mala? Yeah, this is Ben Mala Jr. I did get your text. That's why I'm calling you. All right, hold so, on. Man. All right. All right. All right. All right. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Hold on. All right. This is Tom Nash, the Nash Family Farm. I've been dealing with, with you guys for a long time. We've been neighbors. My grandfather delivered all of your kids or whatever. So you guys need to pipe down and let's meet tomorrow morning. No, 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 Listen. no, 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 I don't care about your unit, okay? It's so only 12 grand. It's, it's or... a... Okay, no, 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 you talk to me, hold on! Easy, Tom, easy. You don't talk to me, we're going to the lawyer. Settle down, okay? We can handle this amicably. No, 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 don't raise your voice at me. Man, we gonna all go to jail. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Come on, y'all. This great when he shits on my fucking credit card. <laughs> Happy birthday, Dad. You're awesome. <laughs> Alright, everybody, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. We need all the subscribers to hit one million. Let's do it. Oh my god, I still <laughs> missed. What the hell? What the hell? He missed twice? find your mother yet? No, I'm waiting for the car in his office to call me back. They got her at one of the hospitals. Oh, so she passed well, away? So what? she passed away? I don't know. We're trying to locate her. Oh, you said the well, car in there. Just say I opened my grandma's fridge two or three times. Uh -huh. Who, you open that fucking fridge one more fucking time? <laughs> That's his mom. Now she's missing. You gotta help us find our grandma. No, I don't want to find her. Hopefully she's in the North Pole. He holds, <laughs> he holds grudges from when he was like 10 years old and she beat him. Post number is 89. Whose idea was bingo? Take the brain working. We get our employees. They're not here to work. They're here to enjoy. Thank you. Yeah. Hey. Finally, please. I don't care if it's wrong, just do it. I want to thank everybody, I, for me and my entire family, we truly appreciate. Cayete!
Adios mio! Carol, you got a Garmin watch. So maybe you'll know what time it is so you can have your ass to work on time. <laughs> We're here at our hotel in Tampa in the West Shore District and our neighbors are going down. Hey, you want to talk to me on the phone? Go to benmal.com slash shop, console with Ben. Let's talk about how you can make some money. Subscribe, watch another video. Don't forget about benshotels.com and adios amigos.